welcome to our tutorial on cryptocurrencies. In this video, we will be explaining in depth what cryptocurrencies are, how to use them, and how to invest in them. But before we dive into the details, let's start with a basic definition. A cryptocurrency is a digital or virtual currency that uses cryptography for secure financial transactions. It operates on a decentralized network, meaning that it is not controlled by any government or financial institution. In this tutorial, we will be giving you a comprehensive understanding of this revolutionary technology and its potential impact on the financial world. Cryptocurrencies use decentralized technology to allow for secure financial transactions without the need for a central authority. These transactions are recorded on a public ledger called a blockchain. A blockchain is a continuously growing list of records, called blocks, which are linked and secured using cryptography. Each block contains a cryptographic hash of the previous block, a timestamp, and transaction data. In order to facilitate a transaction, a user must have a digital wallet which contains their unique cryptographic key. This key is used to sign off on a transaction, providing proof of the user's ownership of the funds being transferred. When a transaction is made, it is broadcast to the network and verified by nodes, or computers, on the network. Once a transaction is verified, it is added to the blockchain, where it is permanent and unchangeable. This decentralized system allows for transparency and security in financial transactions, without the need for intermediaries such as banks. There are many different types of cryptocurrencies, with the most well-known being Bitcoin. Other popular cryptocurrencies include Ethereum, Litecoin, and Ripple. Bitcoin was the first and is the most widely used cryptocurrency. It was created in 2009 by an anonymous individual or group of individuals under the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto. Ethereum is a decentralized platform that runs smart contracts, applications that run exactly as programmed without any possibility of downtime, censorship, fraud, or third-party interference. These smart contracts are powered by Ether, the Ethereum cryptocurrency. Litecoin is a peer-to-peer -peer cryptocurrency that was inspired by Bitcoin. It was created to address some of the limitations of Bitcoin, such as slower transaction processing times. Ripple is a real-time gross settlement system, currency exchange and remittance network created by Ripple Labs Incorporated, a US-based technology company. Ripple is built upon a distributed open-source protocol and supports tokens representing fiat currency, cryptocurrency, commodities, or other units of value such as frequent flyer miles or mobile minutes. There are many other types of cryptocurrencies, each with their own unique features and purposes. It is important to research and carefully consider which cryptocurrencies may be the best fit for your investment goals. Decentralized cryptocurrencies, such as Bitcoin and Ethereum, operate on a decentralized network and are not controlled by any government or financial institution. This means that transactions are verified by a network of computers, rather than a central authority. Centralized cryptocurrencies, on the other hand, operate through a central authority, such as a bank or government. This central authority has control over the issuance and management of the cryptocurrency. One of the main benefits of decentralized cryptocurrencies is that they are not subject to the same level of control and interference from central authorities. This can make them more resistant to censorship and fraud. However, it is important to note that decentralized cryptocurrencies are not completely immune to these risks, and it is still important to carefully consider the security of your investment. Centralized cryptocurrencies may offer some benefits in terms of regulation and oversight, but they also come with the risk of reliance on a single central authority, which can make them vulnerable to manipulation or failure. It is important to carefully evaluate the pros and cons of both centralized and decentralized cryptocurrencies before making an investment. In order to use cryptocurrency, you will need to set up a digital wallet. A digital wallet is a software program that stores your cryptocurrency and allows you to send and receive cryptocurrencies. There are several different types of digital wallets, including software wallets, mobile wallets, and hardware wallets. Software wallets are programs that you can download and install on your computer or mobile device. These wallets offer a high level of security, as they are stored locally and are not connected to the internet. Mobile wallets are apps that can be downloaded onto your phone and allow you to manage your cryptocurrency on the go. These wallets are convenient, but they also come with a higher level of risk, as they are connected to the internet and can be more vulnerable to hacking. 
hardware wallets are physical devices, such as USB drives, that store your cryptocurrency offline. These wallets offer a high level of security, as they are not connected to the internet and are stored physically. To set up a digital wallet, you will need to choose a wallet provider and create an account. Follow the steps provided by the wallet provider to complete the setup process and create your wallet. Make sure to carefully follow any security measures recommended by the wallet provider, such as setting up two-factor authentication to ensure the safety of your cryptocurrency. There are several different ways to purchase cryptocurrency, including Exchanges, online platforms that allow you to buy and sell cryptocurrency using fiat currency or other cryptocurrencies. To use an exchange, you will need to create an account, verify your identity, and transfer funds into your account. Once you have funds in your account, you can use them to purchase cryptocurrency. Direct Purchase Some platforms and individuals allow you to purchase cryptocurrency directly using methods such as bank transfer or credit card. Bitcoin ATMs, physical kiosks that allow you to purchase cryptocurrency using fiat currency. Over-the-counter, OTC, trading, buying and selling cryptocurrency directly with another person, rather than through an exchange. Before purchasing cryptocurrency, it is important to carefully research and compare different options to find the one that best fits your needs. Make sure to consider factors such as fees, security, and the reputation of the platform or individual. It is also a good idea to diversify your investments by purchasing multiple types of cryptocurrency. Once you have set up a digital wallet and purchased some cryptocurrency, you can use it for transactions with merchants and individuals who accept cryptocurrency. To make a transaction, you will need the recipient's cryptocurrency address. This is a unique string of letters and numbers that identifies their digital wallet. You can then send the desired amount of cryptocurrency to their address using your digital wallet. The transaction will be broadcast to the network and verified by nodes on the network before it is added to the blockchain. Once the transaction is recorded on the blockchain, it is considered complete and irreversible. It is important to carefully check the recipient's address and the amount of cryptocurrency being sent before making a transaction, as mistakes cannot be undone. Keep in mind that not all merchants and individuals accept cryptocurrency, and it may not always be practical to use for transactions. It is a good idea to have a backup method of payment available. Fiat currency is traditional currency that is backed by a central authority, such as a government. Examples of fiat currency include the US dollar, the euro, and the Japanese yen. If you want to convert your cryptocurrency to fiat currency, you can do so through a cryptocurrency exchange or by selling your cryptocurrency to an individual who is willing to pay fiat currency for it. To convert your cryptocurrency to fiat currency using an exchange, Create an account on a cryptocurrency exchange that allows you to exchange your cryptocurrency for fiat currency. Transfer your cryptocurrency from your digital wallet to the exchange. Once the cryptocurrency is in your exchange account, you can use it to purchase a fiat currency of your choice, such as US dollars or euros. Withdraw the fiat currency from the exchange and transfer it to your bank account or use it to make purchases. Keep in mind that exchanges may charge fees for cryptocurrency exchanges and withdrawals, and the exchange rate for converting cryptocurrency to fiat currency can fluctuate. It is important to carefully consider these factors before making a conversion. Before investing in cryptocurrency, it is important to carefully research and consider a variety of factors. Here are some steps you can take to research different cryptocurrencies. Understand the technology, research the underlying technology of the cryptocurrency, such as the blockchain and how it works. This can help you to understand the potential benefits and limitations of the cryptocurrency. Consider the team, research the team behind the cryptocurrency, including their background and experience. A strong and reputable team can be a good indicator of the cryptocurrency's potential success. Evaluate the adoption and usage, consider the current and potential adoption and usage of the cryptocurrency. A cryptocurrency with a strong user base and practical real-world applications may be more likely to succeed. Assess the competition, research other cryptocurrencies in the same market and consider how the cryptocurrency you are researching compares to its competitors. Consider the potential risks, research the potential risks of investing in the cryptocurrency, such as regulatory risks, technological risks, and market risks. By thoroughly researching different cryptocurrencies, you can make more informed investment decisions and potentially increase your chances of success. 
Diversifying your portfolio means investing in a variety of different assets in order to spread risk and potentially increase returns. This is especially important in the volatile world of cryptocurrency, where the value of individual cryptocurrencies can fluctuate significantly. One way to diversify your cryptocurrency portfolio is to invest in multiple different types of cryptocurrencies. This can help to mitigate the risk of investing in a single cryptocurrency, as the performance of one cryptocurrency may not necessarily reflect the performance of the entire market. It is also a good idea to diversify by investing in a combination of short-term and long-term holdings. This can allow you to take advantage of both potential short-term gains and long-term growth opportunities. It is important to note that diversification does not guarantee a profit or protect against loss. It is still important to carefully research and consider the potential risks and rewards of any investment. Investing in cryptocurrency carries inherent risks, and it is important to carefully consider and manage these risks in order to protect your investment. Here are some strategies you can use to manage the risks of investing in cryptocurrency. Diversify your portfolio, as mentioned earlier. Diversifying your portfolio by investing in a variety of different cryptocurrencies and a mix of short-term and long-term holdings can help to mitigate the risk of investing in a single cryptocurrency. Set investment limits, decide on an investment limit beforehand and stick to it. This can help you to avoid overloading your portfolio with a single cryptocurrency and can also help to prevent you from making impulsive decisions based on short-term market fluctuations. Use stop-loss orders. A stop-loss order is a tool that allows you to set a certain price, at which your cryptocurrency will be automatically sold to minimize losses. This can help to protect your investment in the event of a sudden price drop. Stay informed, keep up to date with developments in the cryptocurrency market and industry. This can help you to make more informed investment decisions and respond to potential risks or opportunities. By using these strategies and being aware of the risks of investing in cryptocurrency, you can help to protect your investment and potentially increase your chances of success. One of the main risks of investing in cryptocurrency is the volatility of cryptocurrency prices. Cryptocurrency prices can fluctuate significantly in a short period of time, and it is not uncommon for the value of a cryptocurrency to drop significantly overnight. The high volatility of cryptocurrency prices can make it difficult to predict the performance of a cryptocurrency and can result in significant losses for investors. There are a number of factors that can contribute to the volatility of cryptocurrency prices, including Market speculation, cryptocurrencies are often subject to speculation, which can drive up or down the price based on investors' expectations and emotions. Regulation, changes in regulation can impact the demand and supply of a cryptocurrency, leading to price fluctuations. Adoption, the adoption and usage of a cryptocurrency can affect its price, as increased demand can drive up the price and decreased demand can drive it down. Technological developments, advances or setbacks in the technology behind a cryptocurrency can impact its price. It is important to be aware of the potential for volatility when investing in cryptocurrency and to carefully consider the risks before making an investment. Another risk of investing in cryptocurrency is the lack of regulation in the cryptocurrency market. Cryptocurrencies are not currently regulated by most governments, and there is no global regulatory body overseeing the market. This lack of regulation can make it difficult to protect investors in the event of fraud, market manipulation, or other issues. It can also make it challenging to resolve disputes or recover funds in the event of a problem. In addition, the lack of regulation can make it difficult to predict the future of the cryptocurrency market and the potential impact of regulatory changes on the value of cryptocurrencies. It is important to be aware of the lack of regulation in the cryptocurrency market and to carefully consider the potential risks before making an investment. It is also a good idea to research and choose reputable platforms and individuals for investing in cryptocurrency. Another risk to consider when investing in cryptocurrency is the potential for cybersecurity threats. Cryptocurrencies are stored in digital wallets, and if a wallet is hacked or the private key is compromised, the funds stored in the wallet can be lost. There are a number of ways that hackers can attempt to steal cryptocurrency, including phishing attacks. Hackers can send fake emails or create fake websites that look legitimate in an attempt to trick users into giving them their login information or private keys. Malware, hackers can install malware on a user's device to gain access to their cryptocurrency wallets. 
Unsecured networks, connecting to unsecured networks, such as public Wi-Fi, can make it easier for hackers to access a user's device and steal their cryptocurrency. It is important to take steps to protect your cryptocurrency from cybersecurity threats. This can include using strong passwords, enabling two-factor authentication, and avoiding connecting to unsecured networks. It is also a good idea to use a hardware wallet, which stores your cryptocurrency offline and is not connected to the internet, for added security. By being aware of the potential for cybersecurity threats and taking appropriate precautions, you can help to protect your investment in cryptocurrency. In this tutorial, we covered the following key points about cryptocurrencies. Cryptocurrencies are digital or virtual currencies that use cryptography for secure financial transactions. They operate on a decentralized network, meaning that they are not controlled by any government or financial institution. There are many different types of cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and Ripple. Each cryptocurrency has its own unique features and purposes. To use cryptocurrency, you will need to set up a digital wallet and purchase cryptocurrency through an exchange, a direct purchase, a Bitcoin ATM, or OTC trading. You can use cryptocurrency for transactions with merchants and individuals who accept it. Transactions are recorded on a public ledger called a blockchain and are verified by nodes on the network. You can invest in cryptocurrency by researching different cryptocurrencies, diversifying your portfolio, and managing risks through proper investment strategies. There are potential risks to investing in cryptocurrency, including volatility of prices, lack of regulation, and cybersecurity threats. By understanding these key points, you can make more informed decisions about investing in cryptocurrency and potentially increase your chances of success. While there are risks to investing in cryptocurrency, many experts believe that it has the potential to revolutionize the financial industry and change the way we think about money. Here are some potential benefits and uses for cryptocurrency in the future. Increased efficiency. Cryptocurrencies can facilitate fast and efficient financial transactions without the need for intermediaries such as banks, which can save time and reduce costs. Greater financial inclusion. Cryptocurrencies can allow individuals and businesses in underbanked or unbanked areas to participate in the global economy. Increasing financial inclusion. Increased transparency. The decentralized and transparent nature of blockchain technology can increase transparency and reduce the risk of fraud in financial transactions. Potential use in various industries. Cryptocurrencies and blockchain technology have the potential to disrupt and transform a variety of industries, such as real estate, supply chain management, and voting systems. While it is difficult to predict the exact future of cryptocurrency, it is clear that it has the potential to significantly impact and shape the future of finance and beyond. It is important to note that investing in cryptocurrency carries inherent risks and is not suitable for everyone. The value of cryptocurrencies can fluctuate significantly and there is no guarantee of a profit or protection against loss. Before investing in cryptocurrency, it is essential to carefully consider your financial situation, risk tolerance, and investment goals. It is also important to be aware of the potential risks, including volatility of prices, lack of regulation, and cybersecurity threats. It is recommended to seek professional financial advice and to thoroughly research and carefully evaluate any investment before making a decision. By understanding the inherent risks of investing in cryptocurrency, you can make more informed and responsible investment decisions. In conclusion, cryptocurrency is a revolutionary technology with the potential to transform the financial industry and beyond. While it carries inherent risks, it can also offer significant rewards for investors who are willing to carefully research and consider the potential risks and rewards. By understanding how cryptocurrency works, how to use it, and how to invest in it responsibly, you can make more informed decisions about whether it is the right fit for your investment goals. Thank you for watching this tutorial on cryptocurrency. We hope that it has provided you with valuable information and insights on this exciting and rapidly evolving technology.